video of how to get CDK. But before all that, I want to show y'all special something. So if we see over here, my friend, you see that merch he's wearing? Got a fire, huh? Look at that. So that's the merch which you can buy for only five Robux. It's called Shade Legion. Right here. And the first person I see with this merch will be in my next video. Mm hmm. That's a guaranteed. So, that's one I wanted to show you guys. It's pretty cool. Now, it's time for me to show you how to get CDK, one of the strongest swords, or well, if not the strongest sword in the entire game. For its high damage. So let's show you how to get it. First, what you need is um a gosh well no what you first need is to be in third C that's what you want to be that's what you want to do first be 1500 then you can obtain Yama not Toshida but Yama so for Yama you need to kill either 20 to have a chance of getting it of pulling it or 30 so we'll have a guaranteed 100% chance of pulling it right now I have killed 99 elite hunters you need to kill 20 or 30 in that range and uh, if you do kill them all you want to teleport to Hydra Town or just go to Hydra Town Try pulling these swords, but you're the one surviving. So you can try pulling the uh, the Yama when you have 20 or 30, and if you pull it, you have it. But the next thing you need is to get 350 mastery on each sword. That's one of the things you need to do. To do it. So I consider you to start using the um, like The best way to get it is by bosses. Or if you have two times mastery, then just go to T. Then the next sword, Tashida. For Tashida, you need to be level 2000 for Tashida. Then what you need to do is spawn Rip Indra. But you're not going to kill Rip Indra. You're going to go to Hydra again. But you saw the waterfalls in Hydra, right? You're going to have to go through one of them. So if we go back to Hydra Town... Okay, if we keep on going. All the way over here. You see all these waterfalls, right? But the first one to your right is the one you have to do. Meanwhile, Revenge is teleporting. You have to. You can enter one of these. Once you enter them, you have to go through a white. Um, a white door. They'll be glowing. Once you go through that white door, you have to find five torches and light them. First one is over here. First one is over here. Wait, what, what the? 
lights it up. So, over here, this is the first one. Boom, you light it up, because it's in order. That's the first one. The next one is like right here. Over here, boom. The third one is over here. It's in pineapple. right here pineapple the very big one in the middle tree the one on the top and the next one is on the broken down boat the next one is over here next to the mythological pirates next to the mythological pirates over here and the last one is over here. Boom. Then it will say you can enter my hideout, which is hideout is located. Or dashing. Wait, what can I just teleport right here? His next one, his hideout is like over here. You see him, it's just, yeah, Lagma. He, Lagma has a fast regen, so I need to kill him pretty fast. Lagma right here. Lagma. Ah. Once you do it, once you kill him, it will have a 100% chance of dropping to Sheeta. Once you kill them, you have to be able to for to get the complete CDK, well, you have to have 300, 350 master on Toshido too. And then to get CDK, you need to be level 2,300. Once you get to that like recommended level, you just dash, 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 dash. all the way up here. But to open that um door to do the cdk people forget to talk to the crypt master you need to talk to him and then he should open the door here once you open the door there should be a lot of skeletons which you have to kill then you can do the tashita course the tashita scroll the first one talks about the dogs and what you have to do is you have to Whoa, I took up the wrong one. You need to go all the way to the docks. You have to go to three docks. The first docks is Manch, uh, in Turtle. Second docks is in Hydra. And the third docks is in Sea Castle. You know, it doesn't have to be in order. So you just go to here and you go down here. You can talk to whichever boat dealer I like to talk to. Fancy like that. And then you talk to him. You keep on clicking next, and then there should be a pop up where it says, Never mind, uh, like, uh, no thanks, or, um, uh, talk. And then you should talk to him, and then keep on. You know when you try to teleport and you click the V move? I hate that. And then you need to go to. Sea Castle or Sea Castle. And then you need to go to Sea Castle right here. Do the same for him. Keep scrolling, click talk. Then, last one. Is Hydra. Pretty far from the ladder or light. Oh, I found it right there. Then 
Last one's the last one. Once you do that, you can go back to her match. Nobody has killed Captain And then... Pretty good move for transformation. For transportation. Then you uh, can go to the next one. Which is... um. Killing, doing a pirate raid in Sea Castle. It may take one hour. If you're on a private server, it has to take one hour and 30 minutes. But if you're in public, you can just like wait. And then you do, and then you have to like at least take one kill. And then you can come back and just do it. And just uh, do the next one. I think that one's pretty easy. The next one is even harder. You have to. What's happening? I'm teleporting to the wrong spots. You have to go to where Big Mom is, Ice Cream Island. And then you have to kill her, but in under two minutes. That's pretty hard. If, uh, well, if you're Buddha, Buddha Spammer, that's quite easy. Uh, for other people, it's pretty good. Me. And then the last one. Ooh. Then you can burn the scroll. Bring the Tashida scroll. Then we move to the Yamas. For the first one of Yama is Pain and Misery. I think this called. Then you just have to like take damage to these guys. If you get really low, just like evade them, regen, and then keep on attacking. Get really low, and then um uh you should do it should be complete, and then that's pretty easy. That's really easy actually. And then comes the hardest one, which is I think it's Haze of Misery or something. And then you have to kill all NPCs in each island that have a pink center in the middle of them you have to kill them keep on killing them until that pink thing disappears you need observation for that keep on killing them once you kill them all it should appear don't from and remember the zombies where you get the yama sword are also counted as npcs and then the last one is the uh reaper fear of death or something which you have to spawn the soul reaper and then die to him you'll get taken to a hell's gate and you have to like light up torches oh i forgot about for the big mom too you'll get taken to a heavens and for this one a hell's gate you can light up three torches it doesn't have to be in order and um you have to like kill the npcs once you kill them all uh well you'll get teleported back and you'll completed that scroll and then, last of all, you uh, will get six um, of the mythical fragments. And then what you need to do is... Why does it take ages to get over here? Then you have to come and talk to the uh, center stone. There should be one right here. And then it will make it into a gym and you will have to defeat a skeleton boss i recommend buddha and then you kill it and it may take a few seconds but you will obtain cdk and then just become a happily or a peep here and that's it if you haven't yet please subscribe and uh have a good day